Hey guys, Prince of Mastodon here. Gonna do a live commentary video for Rome Total War. And I got smacked into a 2v2. I couldn't find a free-for-all. Couldn't find a 1v1. Couldn't find a siege battle. So here we are. And um, I got stuck with this guy, Apostolus. And I saw him go to Scythia, so I'm assuming he's gonna go with a skirmish build. So I didn't want to go with an infantry cab with some archer build. You know, a bounce build. I figure he's gonna be going uh, skirmish, so I went skirmish too. I would say go all one thing or all the other thing. So what's this go all skirmish against these Romans here? So we'll see how this goes. Hopefully that's what happens. Alright, he is still looking at something. Alright, here we go. So Eastern factions taking on the Romans. We got a good mix of barbarian with, you know, Greek influence. <clears throat> this is a day for the histories. So I see a lot of cab units, it looks like. Already? It's hard to tell. So I'm thinking headhunting maidens and archers. Hopefully that's what he did. So let your battle cry put fear into the enemy. Done team battle, you get to be on the same page. Let's go see his army. What do we got here? Yep, headhunting maidens. Barbarian cav. I'm gonna say six headhunting maidens, one barbarian cav unit. Three archers, two warhounds. I would not have bothered with warhounds, that's a useless unit. If we're gonna skirmish, skirmish. This is not a skirmish unit. Especially two of them, that's whatever. Hey, look at these uh, handlers. They look kind of like uh, Severus Snape. It's Severus Snape and... Uh... Oh my gosh, I forgot his name. Oh, Sirius Black. Sirius Black because he's a dog. Ish. So let's kill these archers. <laughs> I don't know, this guy has a lot of archers here. A lot of upgrades on him too. Hopefully my ally can tie him down. I have to handle these these urbans. I handle this cab without dealing with the urbans. He's running. I shall run too. You know what my ally could do? He could just do a straight up charge with his maidens. And just wipe out these freaking uh, archers. <coughs> I will lend some help. I don't think he needs it though. Yeah, what's help him? Good job, Scythia. The enemy general is killed. Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. Well, I think we rocked this game pretty fast. That's pretty much all she wrote. The gods have filled the enemy general with fear. 
Now he flees the field like a coward. The gods be praised! The enemy's hearts are full of fear, and now they flee. Ooh, 6G, that's even better than a GG. Let's go kill some archers. Too bad this isn't like StarCraft where you can backstab your ally. That'd be so funny. You know, turn off your alliance and then start attacking them. Charge! You know, I would, but I don't like this is a glorious team battles. Achievement. Your victory is total. <coughs> Crushing would be a better word. Crushing would be a better verb. Oh well, good game. Always fun to see Romans die to Eastern factions. And we'll look at the armies really quick. It was the Julii and Scipii, and then we were the Seleucids and the Scythians. So here is ZJ Treat's army here. And here is Interdimensional Toaster's army, the host. Here is my army of the Seleucid Empire. And then my allies' army, Apostolus Scythia. Still, I don't. I don't think those uh, warhounds were a good idea, but it worked because the uh, the Roman guy he was taken on was he had no infantry, so this straight up charge with maidens taking on Praetorian cab just it just it, it just wrecked him. Good game. <laughs>